what does a HDMI capture card do? It basically gets a signal from another device and turns it into something you can use on your computer. That's an overview of it. To support this video, I've got a link in the description to my mailing list. Make sure to sign up to that and you'll get an instant email with help sheets, guides and frequently asked questions which will help you get through this journey. But a more detailed view is if you have something with a HDMI out, what is a HDMI out? HDMI is a type of a connector which is a cable that you can use to get signal from one device to another. If you have a, a DVD player, if you have a computer console, you'll know what a HDMI is because that's what allows you to turn, uh, plug the system together. So think of it like a lead. It leads the signal from one device to another to output a signal. But what you can use a HDMI capture card is uh, to do is use the HDMI card and get a USB signal into your computer or laptop, which in turn allows you to use a video feed on your computer, record it, and even live stream it. So if you're doing any type of uh, live streaming on Facebook, Zoom, Twitch or anything like that, then this type of thing would come in very handy because you can basically get your feed in a cheaper way. The alternative would be buying a camera which is designed to be used in that way, which obviously costs a lot more money. So if you were to buy a cheap camera with a HDMI out and a clean HDMI, what a clean HDMI is, it shows that the feed you are seeing does not have any menus on it because some cameras by default when plugged into a HDMI will show you things like battery life or is it in focus, those little menus that you see on there. So when you're buying a camera, make sure to check if it is a clean HDMI out, get a cheap HDMI capture card, plug it into your computer and you can actually record videos and stream videos over multiple sites like Facebook Live, Twitch, Zoom, Skype, you could use it for meetings and things like that. So that's what a HDMI capture card is. It's basically a little device that turns your signal from your camera into something you can use on your computer to record your video. So you can get different types in higher price range and lower price range. There's a number of factors that you need to think about when you're buying a HDMI capture card. What is the intended purpose of it? So with the capture card, you're basically gonna be feeding video or some type of signal from a device. That can be a games console, it can be an integrated component like a DSLR camera, anything like that. But the capture card is basically something that converts the signal to be able to use it on your computer. The different types, like the Elgato, there's this cheap one, which is probably about 20 pounds. I'll put a link in the description so you can pick this up if you're interested in it. There's limitations of them. If you need it for gaming, you might want a faster speed what I mean by speed is frame rates. So frame rates, if you're gaming, you'll know what that is. It basically, if your screen jumps and it lags, you, you can call that a frame rate, how much of the game you can see. If it's a 30 frames a second, you won't get as much of a real life experience as you would if it was 60 frames a second. If it's 1080p, it might not be as good as 4K. So looking at those budgets, you want to get a card with those ratings. So if you were to get a 4K 60 frames a second capture card, it's going to be a lot more expensive than a 1080p 30 frames a second card. This is sufficient for this type of thing, which is video. However, if you want to do a full on gaming experience and set that up separately, get one of the more higher rated cards. But that is your overview of what a video capture card is and what it allows you to do. I'll link it to a few more videos about my HDMI capture card and how I set it up because I don't use it for gaming. I use it for live streaming, for talking to people over interview on live sessions and also making videos like this.